So we're given these uh, exponent expressions and we need to identify which is greatest. So I'll first try to write them uh, so that they look somewhat, have a similar form and then go about comparing them. So here I'll start with e. So 3 squared is 9, so this is the same as 5 to the 9. Um, here this power of power, so we can multiply the exponents here. So this is the same as 3 to the 10. And then 2 to the 5 is 32, so this is 3 to the 32. So clearly this one is odd because 3 to the 32 is greater. And then this would be 2 to the 15. Again, 3 to the 30 is larger because we have a larger base and a larger exponent. And then 3 to the 5th, um, so I know 3 to the 4 is 81. 3 to the 5th would be 81 times 3. So that's 2 to the power of 243. So here we know that 5 to the 9 is going to be smaller than either one of these. Uh, because you can think of, if even if we were to replace 5 with 8, 8 to the 9, we know 8 is 2 cubed. This would only be 2 to the 27, so clearly that's smaller than 2 to the 43. Use that logic. Now let's about comparing uh, between 3 to the 32 and 2 to the 43. Now I can replace 3 with 4, noticing that this is a larger number than that. And then 4 is 2 square. Why am I choosing 4? Because then I'm able to write this as a base of 2. And this is 2 to the 64. And 2 to the 64 is smaller than that, which means that clearly A is the largest. So um, perhaps with this problem, you don't really need to be able to do all this. But as you can notice that if these were larger exponents, then this approach would be the only option. You know, here, most students might be able to tell that that's clearly larger. But I wanted to give you a little bit more solid logic on that. So to summarize, the answer is A.